Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. In a major boost to Aath Nivar Bharat and strengthening Indian Army, today Defense Research and Development Organization DRDO successfully flight tested indigenously developed low weight fire and forget man portable anti-tank guided missile or MP-80GM. As per DRDO tweet, all the mission objectives were met. Missile MP-80GM was successfully flight tested for the maximum range. The missile is incorporated with state-of-art miniaturized infrared imaging seeker along with advanced avionics. The missile was launched from a manned portable launcher integrated with thermal sight and the target was mimicking a tank. The missile hit the target in direct attack mode and destroyed it with precision. This test conducted by DRDO has validated the minimum range successfully. DRDO along with WEM Technologies Private Limited is developing MP-80GM which is a third generation fire and forget anti-tank guided missile derived from NAG-80GM. The missile has a length of around 1300 mm and weighs around 14.5 kg. It also has an advanced image infrared sensor and integrated avionics. The man portal missile is launched using a tripod which is designed for an operational range of 200 meters to 2.5 km with a launch weight of less than 15 kg. The man portable ATGM is derived from NAG anti-tank guided missiles. The missile can be fired in both guided mode as well as fire and forget mode. The Andios MP ATGM is designed for lofty trajectory which is very dangerous for any next generation tanks. In lofted trajectory, the missile hits the tank from the top. The only soft point in the tank is its turret which is less protected and more vulnerable compared to other sides of the tank. The Andios MP ATGM is capable of hitting tank from the top following the lofted trajectory. It uses advanced seeker which is even better and advanced than Israeli Spike LR, Spike MR or Spike ER. Now Spike LR, MR and ER uses uncooled LWIR seeker due to which during hot summer it is difficult for missile to differentiate the target on the basis of thermal signature. But DRDO's MP-80GM incorporates cooled MWIR seeker which overcomes all these issues. It can clearly differentiate between surrounding temperature and the target temperature. Talking about the launcher system used by DRDO's MP-80GM, it consists of Command Launch Unit CLU, which consists of Target Acquisition Unit TAS and Command and Control Unit CCU. The launcher system weighs close to around 14.25 kg. Although this is not the first time, DRDO has conducted multiple tests of the man portable anti tank guided missile. The DRDO had conducted its first trial on September 15, 2018. A day later, it conducted another successful trial of the missile. On March 13, 2019, the MP 80 GM was successfully tested in Rajasthan. It was again tested in September 11, 2019 using a man portable tripod launcher. So, the various tests were performed by DRDO to check MP 80 GM capability in day and night mode. Also, in the past various tests were carried out with different IR seekers. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.